guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. We are doing another weekly vlog for Camp NaNoWriMo. It is Monday the 6th. I have client work I need to get done today. I have, I'm on page 159 of 262, so not too bad. That's the only one that I have to get done today. Um, I have another one to do tomorrow, but it doesn't need to get done today. I know I look like a potato. I also have a shirt on. Don't worry, I know it doesn't look like it. Um, I wanted to do a quick check-in and a quick introduction to the vlog because today is going to be a nice day. We're going to eat Chick-fil-A today and I am on Autumn's channel. I'm like watching Autumn's channel. So I'm excited to get a lot of work done with her. So yeah. <laughs> I won't feel bad for not completing it all in June because it is pretty, pretty hefty. <laughs> It's kind of funny, whenever I'm uh, joining live streams, I'm such a lurker. Like, I'm not a big commenter, I'll say hello, but I just love to listen. <laughs> Is that weird? Okay, so check in. I know I haven't moved from where I was before. It's much, much later now. It is 6.02. Um, Autumn is still doing her sprints, which she's finishing up, and then... Katie from Kate's book date is doing a sprint right now, so I'm joining that. I finally finished my client work for today. It took me way too long. <laughs> but now I get to actually work on my Camp Nano project, and I'm super excited. So let's get some stuff done, right? Yeah. Start, honestly, we're still at the beginning of the month. You got plenty of time. So we kind of started the sprint already, but I wanted to do a quick check-in. I'm on page 80, and I'm at that word count. So, I'm on page 79. Technically, I'm about to go down to page 80, but you know, it's fine. Hey guys, so check in time. It is, hang on, I had it. I had it memorized. Okay, it's 6 30 on a Tuesday, the 8th. No, the 7th. Seventh. Um, so I am attending Autumn's live stream today. She's having another one, which is so helpful because it's so easy to stay. I've got her talking in my ears. Probably take it out. It's so easy to stay like accountable when there's somebody pushing you to stay accountable. I know I look kind of crazy, but that's because I took a nap earlier today. I still feel like so other under the weather. Nothing like major. Just like I don't know. I haven't had a chance to write on my own stuff today because I took a nap because I didn't feel good and I worked today. So I, it is now 6.36 and I'm still doing some client work. I have got about, I've got a little over 100 pages left. I think I've got 130-ish pages left, which isn't bad. That'll probably last me until eight or nine but then we'll get to some writing on my stuff i'm kind of excited i found this new song it's not new it's new to me but it's walk the moon's lost in the wild song and oh my gosh do i feel so motivated to write young adult listening to that song go listen to that song i'll leave it linked in the description it is so good. i can't i should stop saying that because every single time i say it, i'll leave it linked in the description i forget <laughs> to link it so I should stop saying that so I love seeing everybody that comes to my live streams over on Autumn's live streams it is so exciting to me to see all of my friends just on here so I could talk to them here too I love it so much like look at Lizzie's here Shelby's here Grace Tessie I love it it makes me so excited to attend because I know people that I know are there <laughs> So yeah, I am going to put the camera up, finish the client work, uh, and maybe I'll check in when, I will check in when I'm about to start writing my stuff. Wow, this looks like a horror movie. Oh gosh. Better. Okay, so I'm out in my shed, my glorious Chad. Um, there's going to be a storm coming, which normally I would be a big advocate for, 
Let me close this curtain real quick. There's a storm coming, um, so I'm gonna see how long I can stay out here until, like, if it gets too rainy and I don't wanna carry all my electronics in, cause that's not a fun time. Uh, my mom's gonna come out with me and watch the movie with me, so I don't know how much I'm gonna be vlogging or I'll focus the camera mostly on me. Figure out which movie we wanna watch and we'll go from there. I'm super excited. And I'm super excited for a storm. It has been so hot. I'll check in with you in a little bit. I haven't written any since the last time we checked in um, about writing, so... Yeah. Oh, this is a terrible quality. I'm so sorry. I should have done it facing this way. <laughs> so it's so much better. Ah! Yeah, so I haven't written anything since we last talked about writing. So, yeah, let's get the words written. I want to write them. What do you mean? I mean, it's not writing. Oh. Well, it might. I mean, you never know what's going to happen. Pause. Okay, cool. All right. Hey guys, what's up? It is the next day. Hang on. Let me see if I can prop you up right here. It's the next day. It's actually almost, it's almost 1230 the next day. Um, I ended up getting super sick last night, so I didn't get any writing done. I could have been a better place to prop you up, but I guess there isn't really one, is there? Yeah, so it's 12.30 on the 8th. Um, I didn't get any writing done last night because after we checked in, I ate my dinner. And then I just got super, super sick. So I ended up going to bed early. Yeah, so nothing got, really got done yesterday except for the client work that needed to get done, which is, you know, a good thing. <laughs> client work is always... A good thing today i have about two hours of client work to do today and then tonight is our live stream um so i'm really excited my hair is drying from the shower no makeup on yet i decided to wear a long sleeve shirt with like this jumpsuit romper combo thing and i'm kind of sweating i thought my shed would be a little bit cooler than it is but it's really hot out today so yeah i'm kind of I think I'm having a flare-up of my stomach. That's why I'm having so many stomach aches lately. And flare-ups are not fun. They last for a few days. So hopefully I'm on the tail end of it. My stomach thing is a whole separate conversation. One that really doesn't relate to writing at all. But yes. So today we have um, two hours of client work to do. I'm going to do it right now. I'm going to be watching my favorite, one of my favorite movies. It's called Ready or Not. It's a horror comedy movie. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. Um, I haven't watched it in a while, so I'm really excited to watch it tonight. Today, it's only 12.30, shoot. <laughs> but yeah, so I will set you up and we can cue the time lapse and I'll check in with you guys when I'm done. So, it's a little after two now. Let's move this way so it's not. Yeah, so it's a little after two now. And I read one chapter. And I think one chapter was ten pages. It's not good. <laughs> I was, I, mm, that's my fault for choosing a movie that I knew I liked. Uh, it was a dumb idea. But, you know, if you guys, if you're ever into a horror kind of comedy movie, ready or not, so good. Yeah, so I got nothing done, um, and it's kind of getting hot out here, and my computer is starting to die, so I'm probably going to have to go back inside to my room where the charger is. I so slacked off. Wah! I'm probably going to have to read a little bit during the sprints tonight because otherwise, I don't know if it's going to get done. I've got a lot to read, but I want to work on my stuff, and I just, this is my constant sh struggle. I, I don't think I balance everything right. I think I, I think I'm taking on more than I should be. I'm signing myself up for too many things at one time. Like, I've got, I think I've got like three or four ARC copies to read. Um, I think I have three, almost four. Someone's gonna send me one soon. And then I have a proofread, a proofread I'm doing for a friend. And then I have three client work projects. One's due the 10th. The other one's due the 11th. And then the one after that is due sometime next week. So I've got all that to do. I've got my camp dinner rhino project to work on and I need to finish that. The goal is to finish it by the end of July. It really needs to be done by the end of July. But I was hoping to finish it a little bit early so I can work on my If the Broom Fits edits because I'm a little worried about that. But I do think that I signed, I'm, I'm signing myself up for too many things at one time and it's kind of biting me in the butt right now. 
Especially because I have no motivation, guys. I think it's just how sick I've been feeling lately. It's just been wiping everything out. What a bummer of an update, though. Holy cow. So it's a little after two now. Probably we'll go inside. Yeah, we'll read for a little bit. We'll read. We'll read until. We'll read for an hour or a half hour. We'll read. We'll set a timer, and we'll do those timer sprints like I did last camp. Do you guys remember that? I did those timer sprints. I don't know if about an hour, but I can probably do a half hour. I can probably hold the tension for a half hour. This is a wild vlog. This vlog is gonna be like the no motivation procrastination vlog. <gasps> that rhymed. <laughs> Five bucks. I should I should title it that. No motivation procrastination camp manorimo 2020. We'll figure it out though, and we'll figure it out together. Oh, but that movie though, so good. The computer, cell phone. Let's do this. Okay, no, you know what I need to do right now? And I've been putting it off and putting it off and putting it off. But I need to clean. Ooh, the lighting's horrible. I need to clean my bedroom. If you guys could see it right now, like you can see a little bit in that corner. Oh my gosh. Horrendous. I'd show you. <laughs> but it's horrendous. So... I'm gonna work on that for probably an hour. Hopefully it gets clean in an hour. I have no idea. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I need to, no excuses. Whew. This way you can't see my horrible floor, but you can see my unmade bed and my desk full of pop cans that are months and months old. <laughs> So all these books need to go up on my bookshelf, right? But the books that fit in this corner um, that are supposed to go in there, they don't fit because everything's in alphabetical order. So I'm going to have to push the books down and all the way over to this shelf where it's got some space. So I think it'll be okay, but I thought I could do it with you guys. so much dust. Ugh. Cool. Now, all we gotta do is move these, those, over here. Let's do it. I'm a sweaty mess now, but what's new? So it looks good. I have one book I need to move. Where'd I put it? Oh, it's on the ground. It's a G. Hopefully we can fit it. Okay, Sarah Dessen, Fitzpatrick, Gale. That's almost perfect. Phew. time is it? It's already 4 something? It's 4.13 now you guys. I've got a lot to read still but my room looks pretty nice actually I'm really happy with that. I think before I'm going to sit down and read I'm going to clean out my makeup brushes. I haven't cleaned them in a very long time and I know it's really gross so I need to clean them. I need to give away some books. I'm just not sure how I want to do it because if I if I gave them a, like my library doesn't like accepting books and I'm and I'd love to like send them to people if anybody wanted certain books, but shipping is like 280 for US, which isn't bad on its like if it's just one or two books, but if like 15 people want a book and I have to spend $2.80 to ship it for each book, 
We don't know what to do. Um, but I don't want to throw them away. Obviously not. Yikes. And I don't know what else I would do with them. But there are some books that I know I'm never going to read again. So I just don't know what to do. Anyway, let's go clean out those makeup brushes and I'll check in when we're done. Hey guys, so it's close to like 12.30 now at night. So it's technically the 9th, but we finished the live stream about like 11.30. But we ended it on such an amazing note. We all hit our goals for the end of the night. We wanted to hit, um, which is amazing. I was so excited and I was so excited to celebrate with everybody. And I'm still kind of like riding that high where I'm just over the moon with excitement. So yes, on my work in progress, I am now at 32,000 words. I think I'm on page 109. Not totally sure. I'm away from my computer obviously um but i wanted to give a quick check-in because i think i'm going to be working on client work for the rest of the night since i didn't really get much done earlier in the day today because i cleaned my room <laughs> and i watched a movie <laughs> so i'm probably gonna get some client work done tonight and i probably won't do any more writing writing and since we've had enough time lapses um back to back i think i will spare you i'll check in with you guys tomorrow if i end up writing anymore tonight i will let you guys know as well probably won't though probably will just do client work because i'm getting tired i didn't get a nap in today and i need a nap if i want to stay up late although i did have coffee i did have whipped coffee so i don't know maybe it'll even out who knows but yes so this is the last check-in for the night i will see you guys tomorrow is it really a Camp NaNoWriMo vlog if we don't film in my bathroom? Okay, so it's, it's it, it could be 3 o'clock, it could be 3.30. I don't have my phone on me. It's somewhere in the threes, I think. Um, but um, I don't know if this is going to be the last, one of the last clips of the vlog. So I've got a client work that I need to get done today. Um, it needs to have my full attention today and because it needs to be done by the end of the day tonight before I go to bed, you know. I'll probably be working on that for the rest of this vlog, so I might not show that. Yesterday, I didn't get much done. I didn't end up staying up as late as I wanted to. I wasn't feeling good again. Um, I don't know why it just comes and goes like that. <clears throat> but... So I need to finish that client work. About 270 pages. I think I'm on page 20. So it's going to be a binge reading day for me. Um, and then I don't know how much time I'll have for writing my own stuff. So we'll do a check-in at least just to see where I end up for week two. Um, for me, since week two ends on Thursday. My, my weeks end on Thursday because I, you know, yeah. Honestly, I'm not feeling great about my progress. Um, I haven't really written very much lately, and I, guess, I mean, I guess it's okay. I just know that I've been copying and pasting, and once I'm done copying and pasting, I'm going to feel like, oh my gosh, I don't know what I'm doing. Because there's nothing for me to reference anymore, and I have to do it all myself, which is kind of scary. It's the 8th. No, it's the 9th today. It's the 9th of July. Um, so I mean, I guess I'm at a good spot, but I'm just worried that once I finish with my copy and pasting that I'm going to just fizzle out. <laughs> and that's a scary, scary feeling. Especially because I know it needs to go to beta readers in August. But on a lighter note, you guys, we hit 500 subscribers on this channel! I think we hit 500 subscribers about two days ago. And I wasn't sure if I could celebrate it because... On my channel, it said 500, but on my YouTube Creator Studio, it said like 480. So I wasn't sure which one was actually accurate. So I wasn't sure which one I could celebrate. I didn't want to celebrate 500 if I was really only at 480, obviously. But we're at 500, which is insanity. And we hit 70 reviews on What Are Friends For over on Amazon. And then we also hit 25 reviews of Out of My League on Amazon, Amazon.com, um, which is wild. It's been a milestone week, you guys. That is so crazy to me. But yeah, milestone week. And then next Tuesday, the 14th, What Are Friends For's audiobook goes live. So if you haven't checked out What Are Friends For yet and you prefer the audiobook format, 
the audiobook for Wonder Friends 4 goes live on July 14th. So, yeah, so exciting. I haven't really been talking about that that much because I I don't know. I've just been kind of nervous about it. I've, I'm, I was kind of like, well, is anybody even going to want to buy the audiobook because Wonder Friends 4 has been out for such a long time? But, yeah, I'm really excited now. I'm super excited. Yeah, and I wasn't sure if I could talk about it. I know it's up for pre-order on Amazon. If you want to go pre-order it, you definitely can. The link will be down below. Um, but I'm, I'm doing it through a publisher. I'm gonna have a whole, I'm gonna have a video talking about that a little bit on Monday, so if that sounds something interesting to you, keep an eye out. Um, I will let you guys go for now, and we'll check in in a little bit. Baby needs a haircut. Yes, you do. You need a haircut. It's little Miss's birthday tomorrow. Little Miss is turning four. You're gonna be four years old. You can be four years old and you need a haircut so bad. <sighs> yep. She's gonna be four. Isn't that weird? She's so tiny. She's like a little, little puppy. But she's gonna be four years old. You can say goodbye. You can say see you later. Mwah! Okay, friends. It's about 1.30 at night. In the morning, technically, but yeah, whatever. Let me see if I can pop you up. Um, I haven't talked in a very long time, so I feel like my voice sounds super weird. But I just finished a client work, and oh my gosh, it was the best thing I think I've ever read on that site. One of the best stories that I have read in a very long time. I cried. And I never cry. I have never cried in a manuscript before. I screamed at a plot twist because I definitely did not see it coming. Oh my gosh. So I asked the author that when they publish it, please reach out because I would love to buy it. And when they publish it, I'm going to let you guys know. So get ready. It was seriously the best. I'm still like shaking about it. I binge read the entirety of it, the entirety of the ending, because it was so flipping good. <laughs> ah, it was so good. Oh my gosh. Anyway, um, so it's about 1.30 now, and I just finished it. I just sent that back to her, and I guess I wanted to do one final check-in about my manuscript, and then I'm probably going to go to bed because I'm really sleepy. I took a small nap today. I think I only managed to nap for a half hour. I did not. I, I woke up sick how many times can i mention how how ill i felt today i don't i'm not i'm not trying to mention it on purpose i swear um but anyway i woke up for my nap early so i didn't get much of i didn't get much sleep in so i'm really kind of getting tired so i thought we would do one last check-in for the vlog i still have to edit this entire thing so let's do one last check-in on page 107 and we're at 32,000 words yay yay i don't think that really changed from the last time we checked in but but yeah that is going to be it for me for the vlog you guys i feel like it's going to be super long but weekly ones are always going to be long because they're a week long but yeah so hopefully this was fun hopefully you guys enjoyed it and if you did enjoy it please leave a like go down and scroll down and drop a like oh my gosh i'm so tired drop a like subscribe and let me know how your camp in arrival project is doing what you're at are you hitting your goals are you a little bit behind your goals or are you just throwing your goals out the window and writing the when you feel like it because i'm really curious and i'd love to know and i'd love to talk with you guys about it let's do one quick little chit chat on Monday, I'm going to be hosting a giveaway for hitting 500 subscribers. I don't know if I can do it on YouTube, so it's going to be over on Instagram. But I will talk about it more on Monday's video, so keep an eye out for that. I'm also going to be talking about my audiobook experience since What Are Friends, is, what Are Friends 4's audiobook comes out on Tuesday. Um, wow, I know we already talked about this in the vlog but it comes out on Tuesday which is super exciting and I'm also going to be publishing the first four chapters of Water Friends 4 on Wattpad on Tuesday to kind of like celebrate and um, put that out there more so if you aren't following me on Wattpad yet I will leave link I will leave I will leave that linked down below so you can follow me yeah I, I have some older stories on Wattpad nothing too good so I mean <laughs> if you want to read them you can but yeah so i think that's all i wanted to talk to you guys about before i headed out for the night but yeah 
thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to stick around, subscribe. We have, I post a video every Monday and Friday. And for Camp Anarimo, we are having live writing sprints every Wednesday and Sunday at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. On Sunday the 12th, we are also doing a 10K writing challenge. I'm challenging all of you guys to write 10,000 words in one day. Um, Keelan Rivers and Mandy Lynn also host these 10K writing day challenges, but they're typically on Saturdays, and Saturdays don't work for me. I work on Saturdays, so we're hosting one on Sunday. Did I already say this in this vlog? I don't know. But we're also hosting one on the 29th, so if the 12th doesn't work for you, we're having one on the 29th too. But yes, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you on Monday with another video, or on Sunday with our 10K writing challenge day. Bye. Ah.